County Tournament Finals, and as is tradition, the friend of the county named before the game this year, Tim Schweitzer, one of the legends in Illinois broadcasting. Sports Radio 1450 play-by-play -play man now, as genuinely kind and as dedicated to his craft as anyone in the business. Very fortunate to call Mr. Schweitzer a colleague and sports fans in Central Illinois. Very, very fortunate to have him in this sports community. As for the finals, third seeded Williamsville and top seeded Pleasant Plains an ugly first half, Cardinals led by seven at the break. Second half, Williamsville heats up. J.J. Watson out on the break. It was a five point lead, 27-22. Then moments later, Cole Corson, the freshman, driving hard, finishing left, 27-24. The lead down to three points. Nick Rossetti, a thrill to watch on Saturday night. Three pointer cuts the lead to two. A 15-7 Williamsville run out of the gate in the second half. Sam Pizzabaney gave Williamsville a one-point lead. First lead of the game with 2.30 to play in the third quarter. 33-32, trade some blows now. Michael Cameron picks the pocket. Cardinals back on top by one. Corson comes down off the screen. Bullets back up by one. 18 for Corson on the night. 35-34. Cardinals in the third on a 5-0 run, though, as quickly as they'd lost the lead, they had it back. They led by 4-39-35, heading to the fourth quarter. And that final period, we got to see what makes Nick Rossetti one of the great players in our area. Tough two off the inbounds. Plains lead cut to two. And in that final period, we got to see what makes Plains Braxton Lanier one of the great players in the area. Defense turns to offense, lead back to four. Moments later, Michael Cameron, too much room. Three-pointer is good. Williamsville lead stretched to seven. Rowe and the Bullets refused to quit, though. Rossetti threw a double team. Lead cut to three. 44-41 Cardinals on top. Lanier an answer. Dribble drive. Defense crashes. He finds Logan Gebhards for the deuce. Lead back to five. The back and forth from Lanier and Rossetti was just awesome to watch down the stretch. Rowe from downtown. Five-point lead was two again. And then on the very next trip, Rossetti finds a sliver of space. He pulls it. The game tied at 46. Less than a minute to play. 22 to lead the bullets for Rossetti, but Lanier and the Cardinals get the last lap. Final seconds, Lanier wants the ball, calls for the ball, takes the defender hard to the hoop and gets the runner to go. A game high, 25 for Lanier in the seniors' final county tournament. Brian Graven gets a timeout. He draws up a play to get the ball in the hands of Rossetti, but the inbounds pass is just beyond Rossetti's reach. Plains perseveres 50 to 46. The Cardinals, Sangamon County champs once again. Braxton looked over at me and said, I can take him, coach. So uh, we knew when it got down to about the 10 second mark, he was going, we we're going to get the ball in the middle to him and he's going to go take his fan to hold and it worked out just fine. I was on that side of the court and I was like, coach, I can take him. He's like, all right, get it. So I got it. But he doesn't do it a whole lot, but when he does it, I know he really means it. So, uh, you know, he had the confidence. And I figured that, that's good enough for me. So he said, I can take him, coach. So, you know, and it ran down, the clock ran down, uh, he took the ball to the hole, and, good enough, and sure enough, he did knock it down. Our kids are relentless, you know, and we talked about that at the beginning of the year. You know, no fear. Um, every competition, no matter what it is, we can be playing checkers, we want to win. Um, you know, so resilience, uh, toughness, getting after one another, you know, that's every day in practice, and they showed, showed, it, uh, showed how it comes out in, in a game tonight. We're, we will never give up. We'll just keep coming back, just chipping away, chipping away, but in the end, we just fell short. We knew they were going to be really, really good and prepared for us. We were prepared for them. They just came to talk. They're excited, but they never go away. I mean, you got to expect that from Williamsville, so I mean, just a good game. So that's, that's county basketball right there.